right, Jared. So um, a few people in the comments have said we should check out Harry Mack's Rap God Freestyle. Yes, sir. So that's what we're going to do. YouTube, we are out here. Oh, shit. It's the moment you've all been waiting for. I know y'all know what the fuck this beat is. YouTube, you got to turn your volume up right now, man. We about to do this. We're not about to do it justice. Nobody can do it justice, but... Shout out to the rap god Eminem, we're gonna do what we can. Okay, uh, okay, uh, okay, uh. Like a rap god, rap god, uh. Block the front of nothing, mother dragon slayer, uh. I'm about to run shit like the fucking mayor. He's about to start chemotherapy tomorrow. Hope he finds a way to survive it and get through the sorrow. Shout to the homie named Julio. When it comes to the lyrics, I truly flow. Can you rap about San Antonio, Texas? You know that I'm about to get reckless. Uh, shout to security officer. You know I've been coming right about the top of words. Bro, yo, brand is like playing chess. Every time you manifest, you know that it's fucking fresh. Uh, I be thinking way ahead. I be coming up ahead. I be leaving rappers dead. Uh, shout to the people who be out in Liverpool. You know when I'm ripping on the mic, they gotta listen for. And I'm rapping for the Premier League. Uh, got the lyrics that they could not believe. Thermodynamic. Whenever I slam it, I make the rappers panic. They yelling out, damn it. Polarization. We gotta get. Get past that when it comes to lyrics off the top, I'm dropping mad facts. Oh, you know that we about to make a fortune. Matter of fact, about to knock a rapper off the door hinge. Uh, here we are right now. I be compiling my thoughts. I be wiling a lot. I be amplified with love. I'm about to rise above. I just balanced it out. It's so challenge, no doubt. I'ma say it loud. I'ma say it proud. Any rapper stuff and I'ma slay him now. Present me with your fucking vision. I'm making people listen when I'm all up on my mission. I'm constructing the indecision when I'm getting down. Every Mac I'm coming right up off the tip with all the sounds. I get love out of Hamburg. You know I be square with the damn words. Every Mac I'm coming with the answers. Uh, you know why I'm about to drop a panicky verse. I hope you bring humanity first. Yeah, coming off the tip of this ridiculous man. I'll be flowing and I'm really about to show them Shout the promo bros who'll be giving me the money When I'm on the mic I'm never getting played up for the dummy Yo congrats out to Jerry When I'm on the mic I'm leaving y'all embarrassed I'll be standing like a tower up in Paris Uh, shouts to a soon to be wife When it comes to lyricism I might be killing every mic Shout That's the next level <laughs> And, and and don't let the beat throw you off Because this, this rap god beat isn't supposed to be a hard uh, Grungy, bass heavy beat This is a beat where you show off your lyricism And yeah this is the fastest I've seen him go off the top, I think. Yeah. I mean, it it, lo it looks clearer now that Eminem is somebody who he idolizes mm. in in his rapping. You know, I don't could Eminem freestyle. I don't. I don't know. I think he could. Mm. I remember Eight Mile. Yeah. Right. Would have that battle. Yeah. So that's somebody who I haven't really ever listened to deeply. Yeah. You know, I, I can't call myself an Eminem fan because I haven't listened to him or I didn't listen to him. Mm. But I can tell people who were previous fans of Eminem, you know, find Harry Mack maybe the, the next calling of Eminem. I don't know. Um, I, How do you view Harry Mack compared to Lil Dicky? Mm. Lil Dicky writes. Okay and freestyles on occasion. I, Harry or uh, Lil Dicky's freestyles are more like improv. You know, when he has to. When he you know, when he improvs, it's like a comedy yeah. show. When he's on sway and he says, "Tracy, I brought you flowers." But that was all planned out. It was all planned out, yeah. but the timing was improv, you know, improvised. Okay. But yeah, yeah, th this guy again, you're different and he's reading the the chats. You know, they, they're leaving words, they're leaving phrases, they're, they're leaving personal, personal stories. Yeah, that's different. That's so unique. But just focus on the speed. He's testing himself. Yeah. It's a challenge to him. How? Like, how is this possible? Is, is this, I know the beat rap god, is this the same tempo and style that Eminem did the song? I, in? I haven't heard the song in in a long time. Yeah, but he if Eminem so, does. Like, is he emulating how Eminem rapped over this beat? Mm, then that would be another dimension too. I think he is. I know Eminem. There were times where he he went hard and fast over the beat. Yeah. But you're this. Ooh. Okay. The band shouts out to the man in the bathroom. Go on for a minute, but you know that I'll be back soon. This is for the people who be throwing me the chats in the room. Yo, let's go. Come on with the fresh flow. Go on over heads like a blue cap. If you knew that, who's that? And the dude's sad. Every time he spews raps, you know that people oh about to call me. Greatest from hitting that poly. Uh, calling me the man when I slam. Matter of fact, I'm about to lift you up higher. Every time I'm on the top, it's the skills that I acquire. That's I don't know. In, what's, what's, what?
Jordan. He said, man, I'm about to lift you up higher. And he rhymes that with fire. I don't know. There's, I, I, I am just, the more and more I watch it, the more and more stunned I am. Like he, he truly is a unicorn. Mm-hmm. I have yet to, to listen to somebody like him. I have yet in my entire life to listen to a freestyler who can do what Harry Mack does. You know who he is? He, and, and tell me if this is a bad analogy. He's the Jake Paul of hip hop. It might not add up How completely. So? Jake Paul is shaking up the boxing game and he's not being accepted by the by the mainstream top boxers okay. who spent their lives you know but if from you, the ground up okay okay but if you draw that analogy you you're saying jake paul is as good a boxer as harry mack is a rapper and that's not true okay that's where it doesn't add up yeah. but jared the sentiment jake paul isn't accepted he's he's causing a stir in the game yeah and attention is being given to him yeah just like attention is give, being given to Harry Mack. Jake Paul is bringing the, bringing the attention upon himself. I don't think Harry Mack is doing that. Okay. Yeah, John, right. Harry Mack had the opportunity, in my opinion, to bring the attention to himself when he was 13 years old. <laughs> For the past 20 years, he's been walking, I assume, on Venice Beach, <laughs> <laughs> calling out people's boots and sandals. Mm. Is, this, is this a skill that diminishes with time do you lose mm. this because i almost feel like he's in his prime he's in his prime can he get better i think he can get a little better i think after 20 years you know there comes a peak i think he's right right here he's still climbing i think by age i think with most things by age 35 i'm just throwing out that number you know you start to to turn it might be a slow turn He he might be rapping when he's 65 years old and, and you know still be here what a <laughs> blessing it is to come across harry mack in his prime mm, yeah what a what a blessing that is yeah if there is a peak which i i haven't seen one yet uh, nothing to indicate that there is anytime soon if there is one oh oh he's creating some waves Mm. he's creating some waves but you can't compare him to rappers who who whose bars whose voices just don't add up anymore or sound different like Lil Wayne is a is a good example of that he's still rapping like crazy but his voice sounds different you know he's he's just not in his prime anymore yeah but I don't I wonder if this is different I wonder if he can do this when he's 50. I wonder if this is something that will never <laughs> leave him. And if that's the case, we have 20 more years of Harry Mack. Yeah, and just think about the content. <laughs> can you imagine what he would be rapping about when he's 50? Mm. Not to say that 50 is not old. You know, what, what this man would be rapping about when he's 70, when he's 80. Come on, Jordan. Imagine that. Imagine that. There, I've never, ever seen that. You know how they say speaking multiple languages, being being a uh, polyglot, right? Yeah. Is, you know, it actually helps you. You know, you have a different type of uh, setup in your brain. Like you asked the last episode, you wonder what else this helps Harry Mack with. Mm. I wonder if this is like exercise for his brain. I mean, he seems like he can remember a gr- uh, a massive amount of information. Yeah, yeah. Like, I can't even remember four words at a time, probably. Five words at a time. You tell me, if somebody blurts out five words, I, I don't know if I can recite them. Mm. He can probably remember, like, 20 words. But the good thing about what he's doing is he's showing the kids who can do this. Because there are kids out there who can. Yeah. He's showing them that it's okay to keep practicing. And you, this is something you want to embrace Mm -hmm. 
you know, and, and Jared, there are kids who, who can do it better than him. Maybe they might not even be born yet. There are, there is somebody who's going to come up and do it better than Harry Mack because I'll say this, and this is the only, um, it's not even like a, a negative that I see from Harry Mack, Jared. This is, it, Harry Mack has a signature style. Mm -hmm. You hear that every time he speaks. He sort of sounds like one of the old school, uh, old school rappers coming up in, in the maybe 80s, <laughs> 70s, 90s. Yeah. I don't know. But it's just the cadences, the flows. But then when he switches it up like he did in the last yes. um, episode, it catches you completely off guard because... Yes. It, okay. you, didn't, you didn't think that was in his repertoire. If Harry Mack can, can uh, lead us into this new generation, mm. like the, the Lil Uzi Vert, uh, the the um, Playboy Cardis, and if he can do something with that, like maybe change up his voice or do something... Um, mm. change up his 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 cadences like you know how they say dave east raps the same way every time and someone yeah. like joiner joiner lucas he's starting to change up his cadences starting to get a little bit of uh auto tune maybe even or change you know how he raps yeah i want to see what that's like for harry mack because he does it the same way every time but he flows so so crazy that it sounds different every time yeah what he needs to do what i would love to see yeah is harry mack do something like dj khaled where you create an album with the top 10 20 artists during that time and and each song is unique based on that artist's style you know i want to see him do a song with popcon mm. And then I want to see him do a song with Chris Brown. Okay, that's what's next. You know? Yep, yep. Come on. Because at the end of the day, you forget that Harry Mack is also an artist. Yeah. He's not just a freestyler. Just like Lil Dicky is a visionary, a director. Yes. He's not just a, a rapper. Yeah. Like, there's always more. Yeah. And, and a lot of times, from what I see, rappers, they don't see what's next until it's too late. Mm-hmm. You know, they try to rap into their 50s. In my brain, what I just did is fuse Harry Mack and Lil Dicky. <laughs> now, that, Superman. You know, that, that is otherworldly. You got the complete cutthroat freestyling, and you got the crazy storytelling, production, directing movie. They need to come together. They do. That's what if you're throwing me the fire, uh, what the fuck, this ain't is, this real, yo, people in the world, they don't know the deal, uh, rappers out of luck, man, I'm the one that duck, man, when I get to mind, man, they be yelling, what the fuck, I'm the global legend, I'm the vocal legend, man, every time I'm on it, I preach like the reverend, peace to the people who be throwing me the hearts, uh, peace to the man with the logo of the chart, going up and up, cause I'm on the up and up, you know that I'm coming up, you know that I'm about to leave, I'm thunderstruck, shout out to your beautiful wife named Ellie, rappers don't always got something to tell me, I be getting down when I'm on it, shout out to little Debbie with the cake, you know, I don't make mistakes, I be coming off the top of this, and all my love is great, when it comes to rhymes, man, you know, there ain't no debate, they be throwing me the five, I be spitting hell alive, it's a seven up to me, you know, that they will not survive Shout out to the toe door I be pulling up like a faux door Man, I'm about to run over y'all uh, Rappers really better shape up Cause they know I can do the shit Highest over y'all uh, Any competition that I'm entering Up on my mission You know that I be winning this uh, Every time I pop the pill I get ill with the scale And I will become limitless Doing hard work Cause I know it pays I just have to pause it one more time Harry Mack is a Walking rhyme zone You ever been to rhymezone.com? <laughs> you ever been to that? Yeah um, While Harry Mack is talking about yes. shape ups and finishing up shape up um he saw the word limitless yeah. and he um he automatically knew what word rhymed with limitless he yes. had about like 10 to choose from and he chose winning i, I don't even know what he said because um i can't keep up but do you, do you see yes. what i mean he's the walking rhyme zone he's actually better than rhyme zone he'll give you more rhymes than <laughs> than rhyme zone can list out yep it's amazing oh yeah
Off. Don't quit, man, you know you gotta stay boss Just remember your why, you know I tend to be fly Get you twisted like the Hennessy I Be on a whole nother level every time I run mics Gotta take advantage, cause it's only one life So we gotta live in the moment Gotta go and get it, man, you know you gotta own it I be killing it every time I'm on the mic And I'm ready to be striking Y'all are all my people getting hyped Just like a rhino who be throwing both his hands up in the air uh, Rappers talking shit up on the name, but I don't care Rocking on the top chat, you know that I'm ripping uh, Got my enemies running away like chickens uh, You know I'ma slaughter every family Matter of fact, I'm about to spit seeds like a watermelon uh, I'm about to do it in the new way Two page, you know that I'm cooler than the Kool-Aid Woo! Shout out to Hoovers. I'm Rapping for the shake is a move us, uh Rappers the ones that I'm swallowing Shout out the homie, you know they've been following All of the journey since April in 2017 I'm on the clever scene, I will forever be All up in heaven, G, they say it's crazy I've never been lazy Rappers, they talking that shit on my name But when they be just spitting, they never amaze me Uh, keep on pushing, they giving me respect When it comes to lyrics, I'ma help my people manifest Yeah, these are the words that they throw in Boy, Alice, when I'm on the mic, I'm about to face the challenge You know that I'm really about to do it Eat you like a salad, homie, I ain't never on a ballad I'll be moving fast, try to tell you I'm about to mount you, legend like Zelda Uh, hands, no one who can stop me Waking like coffee, hit like I'm a cause you. Shout out to the Alex Mack. How about the podcast? That would be raw, man. You about to get down. I'm up in the session. Uh, I go deep with the summer being ready to subscribe on the scene. Uh, they will subscribe in a second. Gotta make it happen to my man, I reckon. Uh, y'all know they're trying to be the guy, but I'm like a superhero flying through the sky. Kind of like. <sighs> Jordan, he can do anything. He can do anything. Don't let the, the, um, don't let the, the fact that the beat doesn't hit you or that his flows don't hit you, don't let that put you off kilter. No, what he's this, doing, what he's doing here is straight spitting. Yeah, he's literally spitting uh, faster than you can keep up. Yes, and faster than you can respect. You can't, you can't even respect what he's doing right mm -hmm. here because you, you're just lost. <laughs> you, you can't keep up. He, he's, he goes from looking at words. He's looking at how much they donated. He's looking at flying emoji things and just coming up with thoughts a pair, everything I spit is rare yo why is it always pairs but I don't even care yo thanks for making is that a pair <laughs> that's what I'm saying like is that a pair right you didn't I would have said a flying bird that's not a bird that's a pair <laughs> what it's like he has he, people say they have a voice inside their heads well Harry Max got a whole like uh He's got a whole 911 center in his head. Yeah. And they're all telling him what's coming. Yeah. Harry Mack is a traffic, like his brain is a traffic control center. Mm. Like an air traffic control center. If I am is the rap guard, you are rap Jesus. Every time you kick a bar, people will repeat this. Uh, when it come to rhyming, I'm a better man. I be getting love from the people in the Netherlands. Uh, shout out to the Kristoff. You know I'm a big boss. Rappers in the game, they'll be pissed off. They be yelling out what, but I'm leaving motherfuckers cut. When I'm over tracks, I got a strut. Uh, the real O, oh, they feel flows. I kill those. London is calling my lyrics. It's thumping the pollen. The way that these rappers be spitting, they throw with me. The flames, when I'm in the game, it's insane. All up in my session, I would just remain. Shout out to Miyagi Smith, always coming spamming. Uh, when I'm on the mic, I'm steady slamming. See, Chris is saying so, but I'ma run you over, man. You gotta make a breakthrough, kinda like Red Rover. Gotta keep focusing, you gotta keep a journal. Uh, cause the temptation is eternal. Gotta find a way to get past it when you win it, I smash it. Every making noise about to get drastic. Ain't uh, the person in the industry that's coming to control me. Every time I'm rhyming, they be saying that I'm holy. Calling me the lyrical guard, yo, hey, Harry Max, shouts out to Blood by your thing. Uh, thinking you gonna beat me, better try again. Uh, cyphers, I'm inside of them. Woo! Good God, breathe, man. It's a new level that I will achieve, man. Shout out to the red underscore 10 to the R. Hell of an abandoned the bars. Uh. <laughs> it's so. I feel like we don't deserve this. And and what we do is when we watch it over and over again, we t we start taking it for granted. Mm -hmm. We don't we don't deserve it. it. If people in the in again, this may be a major assumption. If people in the 70s when hip hop was just getting created, yeah. could have ever imagined <laughs> that 50 years from then something like this could take place mm. i mean and again that may be an assumption this freestyling like this may have happened in the 70s i've never heard it but it is insane how far hip hop and lyricism has come in 50 years and not even 50 this dates back Hundreds of years. Yes. Hundreds of years. And what's more insane is that in the current times, always, I remember when I was 13 thinking, oh, 
man, hip hop won't be the same in 10 years. Like when I was 13, Jared, I said, hip hop won't be the same in three years. I won't be able to listen to this song in my car when I'm driving. Well, when, when you were 13, I was also 13. But. <laughs> yeah. But Jared, that is our limited, limited scope. What will happen in 20 years, someone like Harry Mack can can see. He can see the future. That's the the exciting thing. It's so exciting. Is that 20 years from now, I think hip-hop will hit another exponential, wow. exponential curve. Like, you know, we thought, like, if this is the 70s, and this is where we are here today. Oh my goodness. Jordan, oh in my 20 goodness. years, if we're right there, there's no point in doing anything else in your life but listening to hip hop music. <laughs> and I'm sure the same can be said about other genres. Yeah. You know? Mm -hmm. But something about hip hop is universal, it's reaching the masses. When this was created in the 70s, Jared, like you said, they probably never, ever imagined it would be here. And yeah, I agree. We don't deserve this. And, and uh, yeah. there's no possible way to, to even pay respect to what he's doing um, in, in the right way. You, I don't know how. You can't, you can't sit and try to add, analyze what he's saying. Or even he's, react to it. It's he's just so talented that this right here is just for fun for him <laughs> and for, you know, a few hundred dollars. A few hundred dollars. When to somebody else, this is the pinnacle of their career. Mm. This level of rapping mm. and this uh, game that he's playing with words and pictures is the pinnacle of somebody else's career that they will provide to Netflix. You know? For them to create, you know, a an entire production around this. But for Harry Mack, he's got so much potential and so much many things that he can do that this is just another day. Another day. Um, one more question for you, Jared. I know you said you'd like to see Harry Mack in a Super Bowl commercial last time. Yeah. What else would you like to see Harry Mack do? If you were Harry Mack's manager. Where would you guide him? Mm. I don't even know if he has a manager, if he needs one. What I would do, to be honest, at this point, and again, I don't know Harry Mack. I've only seen literally probably five videos of mm. him in my lifetime. Yeah. So I could be completely off base. But if I was his manager, you know, my thought, first and foremost, Harry Mack seems like he has uh, a goal on this earth, and that is to, one, make people happy, and two, spread the art of hip-hop and the, the craft and the beauty of hip-hop as far and wide as he can. Yeah, Those, are, those seem like Harry Mack's two top concerns. So um, if I was a manager, I'd probably add in a third one and say, uh, let's try to push this and see where we can take it in terms of making some money. Mm. And if Harry Mack, if you don't want to uh, accept the money, we can donate it to charity. <laughs> right? So what I would do, it seems like he's been on YouTube and social media for so long. And I don't know whether or not he's reached a plateau. If he hasn't, I would push him to reach that plateau and then decrease the presence on YouTube. Mm. Because I feel like things are getting a little saturated. He's, again, providing people things that they don't deserve. Mm. Our ears don't deserve this. He's doing it every day. People should have so, to pay a yes. lot of money to hear. Not even a lot. Like, like, like You should have to, this should be purchased. Yes. What he's doing here should be purchased. You, sh you can't, and, and the thing is, he's such, again, his, He's so pure in his what he wants that he's doing this for free and just relying on people to donate, you know, out of the goodness of their heart. This should be purchased. That's what I would that's where I would push him is yeah. to 
to be and that's i think how you become commercially in line with some of the other rappers today mm. you know and it always goes back to like juice world juice world didn't do any of this the only time we saw juice world freestyle was at a, a rolling loud interview right or, or things like just a random interview mm-hmm. on a radio network yeah uh not on youtube so yeah all right let's finish this off real quick I, I'm a shot a pick chew Even from a distance reaching you Peace to the people I be speaking to Gotta sip the arrowhead water Uh, don't know that I really got it Uh, I got it for now All you rappers can go Next I know the time I don't leave me no road back Uh, I'm my little speedy bro You know I got facts like an encyclopedia Uh, you know that I'm about to get fouled Make it mouth I'ma hit you like an ass or a bell Yeah, I'm the one you really need to listen to Fly this thing out your mouth Was a wisdom too That was a bite from a man named Milk All the bars that I kick is smooth silk Uh, <laughs> yeah Gotta give credit where it's due and I be really coming through And I came to spit flyer Shout to the homie with the name that is Tyler Three one to the nine five to the line drive Shout to Deshaun Shout to Tyler Anthony when I'm popping up they be like Kennedy Sean's favorite drink is Pepsi Well let's see A lot of rappers in the game will get me to sweat me Ooh. Roll Tide and go Broncos uh, You know that I really go beyond those rappers in the industry You know that they embarrassed I be getting down with the homie who be named Jared Make some H Mac merch for me to buy Yo it's coming real soon and it's about to be fly Man we got the designs and we got the samples And we about to drop the merch store Heavy design for let's go uh, Got these rappers halting kind of like your name When I'm rhyming with the flames Yo great to see all the support today cause you know you really rip it in a gorgeous way You deserve it, it's my purpose Got a nervous, I'ma keep crushing it Every time I'm busting it 2,193 people came in just to hit a live MC So let's go Yeah, y'all, we out here, man <laughs> Double time rap flex, man That shit is nuts Sorry for all the mistakes Sorry for all, Sorry the, mistakes. For all the mistakes I was just gonna say there Sorry are no for all the mistakes That's how you become Okay, I, I'm sorry that's he's how you not, become the he's top not, of your He's craft. not the Jake Paul of boxing. He's the no. Steph Curry. No, he's or, the uh, Floyd Mayweather. He's the Floyd Mayweather. If if he's calling anything that he just did a mistake, then he's Floyd Mayweather. Yeah, he's different. He's different, Jared. There's no fillers. Like, you know how on albums, rappers have filler songs. Yeah. That was just to put it on, you know, to transition to the next yes. one, to fill it up. You, there's no fillers. There's no mistakes. You're really able to see how talented he is when the beat stops yes yep right you are when there's no music you realize oh he's really rapping yep he's really rapping off the top of his head yeah that's true yeah that's it wow ben zen i'm gonna consider that sacrilegious but i definitely appreciate the compliment thank you he said better than eminem (laughs) oh man once again yeah this was this was something Wow. Different but very special. Oh yeah. Um Wow. Again, you know, please point us towards uh the top, top, top notch Harry Mack freestyles. Yes. Um Yeah, I mean this this was great. Any any last words? No, I mean just listening to three so far of his uh, acts. It's unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah. And, th- and it leaves you wanting more. So. Okay. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't. We appreciate you. Peace. Peace.